guys, I'm freaking out. Like, I'm freaking to flip out right now. Because this is not what I expected whatsoever. I've already seen negative comments on this. But guys, think about it. This is a new class of freaking dragons. We, for the last three years, we have had hunters, sorcerers, warriors. That is it. Now we have invoker class of dragons. What the heck? Oh my. Battle like never before. Hidden beneath the world, ancient secrets rested. Locked away and dormant, a veiled species awaited the arrival of a brave soul willing to discover its untold power. power. So someone, that girl, discovered this dragon and she has let it free. And now they are going to be coming to us and gracing us with their presence. Dragon Lords, the fourth dragon class, takes flight in war dragons this summer. Unique and mysterious powers belonging to invoker dragons, which have special play patterns, skill sets, and strategies all to their own. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. If you can't tell, I'm freaking pumped right now. All right. The Invoker Dragon is the fourth addition to the list of classes available in War Dragons, joining the Hunters, Warriors, and Sorcerers of the world. You will recognize them in-game with their distinct class icon and gameplay style. At their core, Invokers could be classified as a marriage between Hunters and Sorcerers. Compared to other classes, Invokers have mid-range HP and strength, and similar to Sorcerers, a majority of their damage output will be derived from spells. Their play pattern is most similar to that of a Hunter, where Dragon Lords can tap a Tap to fire breath attacks. Um, however, there's more involved in the invoker spells than just a simple tap or spell. So this is what makes it unique. By the way, guys, subscribe if you're new. But there's going to be a release of the new divine, uh, which has already been like skill set has been shown off and everything. And that will be going over in a separate video. So once all breath ammo has been spent, all of the four actually will start up at the top. My bad. So a class all to its own. A fourth dragon class comes with its own way to fly in battle and make its mark. It starts with a basic tap to fire attack. Invoker dragons have four breath ammo total. A max of four. That's four shots. The first three will shoot a projectile at enemies, while the four tap will discharge an empowered shot, which will provide a special attack disabling effect or other advantage in battle. This empowered shot's effects and damage output will vary across different invokers as they make their way into the game. Once all four breath ammo are spent, all of the four invoker ammo shots will generate in unison over a period of time. This means that all ammo will become available again at the same time and won't be able to be used until all ammo has recharged. Which, one of the biggest things with that is farms, question mark? Like, how are they going to deal with that? I'm assuming they're going to have spells that can one-shot farms, right? But just something to keep in mind, like taking out max out towers requires a lot of freaking ammo. Um, so anyways, the Invoker class is only class is the only class that features this new style of gameplay. The concept is easy enough to understand but difficult to master. As you experiment with new Invoker dragons in the world, complex and successful strategies will become available and great success will follow. So a visual glide, glide guide to Invokers. Much like hunters, warriors, and sorcerers, Invoker class dragons have a unique body style and features that distinguish them from others, being more mystical in nature, invoker dragons do not have the expected back and front legs known to other classes and take on a more ethereal shape as their wings cascade into a tail. While body styles categorize the class the best, you can expect to see a fresh array of head, wing, and tail designs that complement these new dragons. So, <clears throat> let's, let's look at this. So, a flight with the fourth class. Invoker dragons follow the tap, tap, boom play style. All right. Boom, boom. Um, and will feature new visuals to show when ammo is ready, spent, and recharging. Here's the breakdown. So here we see an invoker dragon ready to fly. The four circles in the top right-hand corner underneath the HP bar that are filled with orange represent the four invoker ammo shots that are able to be discharged. At this point, that's you can see right here um, the two ammo have been spent. At this point, invoker dragon has spent a portion of their ammo leading up to the largest circle, which is the empowered shot. The empower shot always come always comes at the end of the sequence and will deal an effect area or sorry will deal an extra effect or damage boost depending on the invoker dragon. 
The Empowered Shot will discharge like previous ammo taps. You'll know an Empowered Shot is firing as the large orange circle will empty in the Invoker's ammo. And a red ring representing the attack range can be seen in the desired area of destruction. This is specifically for the first Invoker Dragon, which we'll get to in a bit. Yes, we know what the next dragon will be. Uh, when, when all cir four circles are empty, an Invoker Dragon is out of usable ammo and must wait a small period of time to recharge for use once again. The re this reload charge... Um, may vary across Invoker Dragons. Immediately after the Empowered Shot is cast, when the four Invoker, sorry, when the four Invoker Shots ammo circles will begin to fill. Uh, once Invoker ammo is depleted, all four circles will begin charging in unison, which is indicated by the orange color refilling the along the all wait, which which is indicated by the orange color refilling among all four ammo circles at once, as well as the blue bar at the bottom of the screen filling from left to right. Okay. Additionally, a swirling blue glow will encompass the dragon to visually show their ammo recharging. Wow. <clears throat> so, mastering the invoker playstyle is essential to successful flights with these new dragons, while well, the best strategies will be in combination with each dragon's spells. Locking down the ammo basics will be half the battle, the other half being the real battle. Alrighty. So, Namaka. Stay tuned for a video. I got a doctor's appointment, so I'm going to have to go soon. Um, I'll be doing this video after I come back. But, man. So, these dragons will become more frequent, frequently. Fweep, you know, the, like, little um, Barney-looking dragon. Will begin to appear more frequent. Frequently, there we go, in the world of war dragons as new seasons and dragon tiers are revealed. The first invoker dragons discovered comes with the upcoming summer season as the goddess of tides. Stay tuned, guys. But, oh man. This is going to change.